Oh, here we go. Come on. Oh my God. Why is it so extra heavy? What there. the? You just I think this is part of a wheelbarrow. <laughs> we got to make one. What is going on today, guys? Today, as you can tell, we are back out on the boat once again. And today we're going to be magnet fishing a section of river that we've never been to yet. Back in the day, there used to be tons of logging on this river. There used to be all kinds of factories and paper mills. And not only that, but this bridge right here is the main bridge that runs through the city. So there's tons of traffic here. There's tons of history. And as always, you just never know what you're going to find. Let's start tossing and see what we can find today. Today, I do have Alex out here with me. If you guys would like to check out his channel or if you would like to pick up a magnet or some merch, I will leave the links down in the description, guys. All right, guys, we are back out on the boat today. I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. So we're gonna try and get as close as we can. We're gonna poke around under this bridge and then we're gonna poke around on these shorelines. Let's start tossing and see if we can find anything today. Wow, that is long. Dude, I thought I just hit a rock. No, that's heavy. I got something. Oh, it's slipping. Oh, what is that? Something fell off. Yeah, look at that, you guys. What do you think that is? There's definitely some wood up in there, but it looks like just some kind of metal brace or something maybe from the old bridge that maybe used to be here. I don't know, you guys. Definitely some super old looking wood. First find of the day for me, and at the same time here, Alex found him the old rebarski. Couple pieces. A little bit of cash money for the cart. <laughs> Ooh, found me a little something here. Check this one out, you guys. I was just pointing out this old castle looking house up here, man. This That looks old to me. But check this out, you guys. Looks like it's got some kind of loop on there with like an orange cone. And I have seen like different colored cone pieces on construction type stuff. The old bridge construction. Pretty cool, some kind of orange plug. Oh yeah. Dude, whoa. Hey, ha <laughs> ha, you're kidding. Oh. Unreal, dude, there's like a bag on there. There's something in there. Oh, there's a bag hanging off of the bike, you guys. Look at that, the old mountain climber. Oh, look at this mess right here, you guys. Heck yeah, dude, look at how far out. Oh yeah, right here, there is a bag. Yeah. What is this? What's in the bag? Sort of bag? Just a burlap bag, nothing in there. So Some kind of sack. A little knapsack. A little knapsack. <laughs> Somebody had their lunch in there, down by the river. <laughs> And that was, that's a heavy object and it still floated this far. Could you imagine something lighter? It would probably float even farther. And all the years of this rushing water coming out of the dam, it probably just keeps pushing stuff farther and farther down river. Ooh, I got something. Ooh, look it, dude, whoa. Look it. Is that a shower pole? Like a shower rod? No kidding. Or maybe just a curtain rod for like a window or something, you guys. Look at that. Holy oh, cow. Or maybe it is a flag yeah. pole type thing. You might be right. Yeah. That's crazy, man. Holy cow. Oh, look at that. It's got some kind of little ring on there. I don't know, man. Looks like it's got different sections to it for sure. The old white pole with the ball on the end of there. I don't know. Some kind of rod. Uh-oh, don't do me like that. Oh, wait a minute, or do do me like that. Something's moving. Oh, I got me something. Or something's got me. Oh, look at what I got. Oh. Check it out. Oh, here we go, come on. Oh my God, why is it so extra heavy? Look at that sucker, you oh. guys. I caught me the old, what looks like a white BMX bike or something. What the? And again, I guess actually this one's really not that far away from the bridge here. Not as far as Alex's was for sure. We got any fishing lures in there? Honestly, probably not because I don't 
think there really would be anybody fishing from this bridge. The only reason that I can ever think that these end up in the river is that they're stolen, because I would never throw my own bike in the river. Oh, I was gonna say, that feels heavy. Ooh, what the heck is this, you guys? Um, is that like part of a, I was gonna say maybe a shopping cart or no. Is this like maybe some kind of shelving? Looks like we got a couple legs on there. If you stand them all up, you might get yourself something like a little table. I don't know what to think of that, you guys. We do have all four legs though. Look at that thing. It's an octopus. <laughs> Whatever that is, look at all the gunk on there, man. That thing's been down there for quite a while. And again, quite a ways away from the bridge. Holy cow, you guys, as shallow as it actually is in here, I'm surprised. There seems to be this much stuff in there. Is this one of these logging tools? I don't what know what thing? that is. Look at that. That's kind of cool it's looking. Like an, uh, the tool of some sort. I don't know. Yeah, it does look like a hook on the end of there. Look at this thing, you guys. It looks like maybe some kind of wooden handle here, but there's like some kind of little spike on the end of there. What the heck you think that is? That's pretty cool looking. Super old for sure. Absolutely. I don't have a single clue. I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, I grabbed me something here. Yes. This actually is kind of heavy. Hold on. Oh, it's slipping. Stay on there. Definitely slipping. Ooh. Whoa. Yo. No, something else fell off. Something else fell off, but you guys, whoa, look at this thing. If this ain't the oldest bike I've ever seen in my life, and look at there's no seat, no, no pedals, no handlebars, nothing. And look at where we are though, okay? There's nothing but trees here, and we are so far from the bridge, you guys. Now, as old as this bike looks, you guys, I mean, that's gotta be 50 plus years is my guess. And if you can think back 50 plus years, I'm sure this did not look like this at all. There might have not even been any trees here. So this could have been somebody's backyard. It could have been all wide open. There could have been kids playing. It could have been a park. I mean, you just never know. Heck yeah, you guys, let's keep tossing. Oh, here we go. Hitting something again. This might have been, yeah, this is kind of the same area where I just had something fall off of that bike. Here we go. Dude, shut up! Really? Oh my gosh, you guys, a second one. Well, I shouldn't say second one. This is my third bike here today, but this is the second little frame that I just pulled out of this same little area. Holy cow, these two look to be about the same age. Unreal, man. Ooh, something here. Hey, check this out. Dude, that's like definitely the head of a shovel. Not much left of that thing at all, you guys, but you can see where like the wood connects to the metal here. And I think this is the neck and that would be like the shovel head. Unreal, man, look at that one. There's like nothing left of that thing at all. The old scooper. All right, guys, check it out. The bridge we were just magnet fishing is right over there. So now we're floating down the river just a little bit here. And if you take a look at these apartment buildings, back in the day, this actually used to be an old paper mill, I believe. Let's start tossing around here and just keep floating down river. Oh, a couple things hanging off of here. Check that out. Oh, look at that. Got me the old railroad spike. And I don't know, I don't think there's a railroad anywhere around here. No, definitely not. Maybe back in the day, but uh, definitely not anymore. Huh, so that's kind of funky. The old cash money spike -roo. But check this thing out, you guys. What do you think that is? Looks like definitely got some threads on there. Looks like a bolt with some kind of twisty handle. I don't know about this one, guys. Kind of looks like maybe some kind of plug, like you could plug that into something and screw tight. I have no clue. Already finding some stuff over here. Let's keep tossing. Blast out streams of big 
bold colors. Oh yeah, yeah. look at that. <laughs> That's, That's crazy, the old silly string yeah. can. How old do you think that one is? Well, 90s, like 90s, 80s yeah, maybe? Label. Super cool. Uh, Ooh, something here. Yeah, that clicked pretty good too. Ah, what do we got? Now we're getting super close to this wall here. I've always wanted to magnet fish on foot back here, but there's really no way to do it without like risking getting your magnet snagged and not getting it back. Yeah, what do I got here? Looks like, what do we got? The old crayfish hotel, perhaps. Yeah, check that one out. We got any Frankies living in there? Doesn't look like it. Oh, here we go. Sticking something. That's ah, pretty heavy. Yipper. Oh, that's pretty heavy. Oh, we got another. Oh, maybe not, you guys. I was gonna say, we got us another crayfish hotel, but check this out, it's like a can almost. You guys, at first I thought this was another crayfish camper, the old crayfish hotel. But if you look, it's got like a sealed off bottom there. It's almost like a cup or something. And then it's got like a bracket there, like it would hang on something. And then I don't know what the heck that would be. Some kind of cup can deal here. Look at that, man. A little paddle tail hanging off of there. I caught me the old fishing lure, you guys. And honestly, the way that rubber moves, it's still pretty wiggly. You could probably still go fishing with this sucker. The hook doesn't look very hooky, but you could always give it a shot. Heck yeah, you guys. I'd be willing to bet there's probably all kinds of fishing lures up and down these shorelines. The very first night here. <laughs> <laughs> Say hey, something grabbed me here. What do we got? Hey, is this not one of them? Uh, what do piston you call heads. these? Yes, a piston, piston head. Piston. Dude, you guys, this is absolutely crazy. We have never been to this section of river yet. And it's just crazy that we seem to find these in rivers almost everywhere we go, really. We cost the old piston head, which if you don't know, this is like an engine piece. hanging off there you guys another fishing lure boom just down the river here from where i found the other one this rubber looks pretty beat up but honestly yeah look at that jig yeah that's still fishable the old fishing jig nice now we got two of them oh something going on here we're a little heavier Yeah, whoa, what's going on here, you guys? Look at this thing, looks like just a big old ugly chunk of metal, but if you look, there's like some kind of, some kind of spout coming out of there, like some kind of water drain. Who knows what that came off of? Like the old time gutters, your water would run down there and go through the tube. I have no clue, you guys. Just the old ugly cash money. Oh yeah, that's the greatest throw on the history of planet Earth, dude. You've never seen nothing like it. Ooh, what do we got here, you guys? I've just been dragging my magnet, literally. I'm, we're going from this side of the river traveling to this side. I've just been dragging the magnet along with the trolling motor, but look at this here. It's like some, uh, I don't know, is this say maybe part of a decoration? yard piece or something i can't really tell but there's just a bunch of wire kind of wrapped up around another wire that is really weird looking maybe part of a fence or something not much left of that sucker dude 
dude! Well, Look what I just found! Ha oh, hey. <laughs> ha! Jackpot! Got me the old fishing pole, you guys. Doesn't turn anymore there. And it looks like we're missing the whole top yeah, half. Right. Dang it! Look at that, you guys. Shakespeare. Pretty sure that's just a, the old cheaper Walmart brand, I think. But if you don't recognize this location, which you probably don't from the boat, we've actually magnafished here from shore before. And if you remember, this is actually the spot where we got our magnet snagged. I went and bought some waders. We came back and I actually ended up almost drowning and I'm not even kidding. And that is a video on my channel if you want to go see that. We got to make one. Dude, what is that? Oh, you got two funky looking things. Oh yeah, I didn't even notice that. That looks like a mini yeah, frying pan. Yeah, for sure, dude. Like a single egg pan. <laughs> what <laughs> the? Egg would fit in there. Dude, that's yeah, cool. That is super cool. You guys, check out this little two for one Alex just got. This looks like a little cast iron pan, I think. A lot of these have some kind of marking on the bottom, so maybe this one would too. I don't know, but that's like a single egg pan. That's crazy looking, you guys. Unreal. <laughs> Cookie some eggs. Couple river eggs. <laughs> and then he caught this thing here. I don't know. Definitely some kind of solid steel box. But if you look, I mean, it's like hollow in there. So it is some kind of box. Hey, look at that's like a keyhole. Really? Yeah. Right on the front. That's definitely a keyhole, dude. Look at that. Right here. Oh, no kidding. For sure. Yeah, right, right. Unreal. Oh, B. That's is it? wild, man. Yeah, I don't know what this could be, you guys. Looks like some kind of lock box, though. I don't know. Whatever it is, it's, that sucker's oh, old. Shit. Oh, yo. Oh, my gosh. Dude, that is what I think it is, too. It's a big old saw. What in the world? Look at the teeth on that bad boy. Oh my gosh, man. This thing's for cutting down them big old redwood trees. Is that what they're called? Them hundred. <laughs> yeah. And if you remember in the beginning of the video, right up by that bridge there is where I was talking about there being a lot of logging going on back in the day. So boom, there is your evidence. That is just absolutely massive. <laughs> In the size of that thing, that's really meant to get in. Ooh, something heavy here. Oh yeah, what do we got? Ooh, couple of things, you guys. First of all, look at that funky thing. Definitely looks like some kind of stand for something, but it's got like some clips on the bottom so it might clip onto something. What the heck you guys think that is? The old flagpole holder? I don't know, I've never seen nothing like that before. And then we also had this thing on there for the old two for one. You can definitely see the metal frame on there, but it looks like there's some kind of wood up inside there. Maybe some kind of handle off of something. What the heck you guys think that one is? That's a funky little two for one, you guys. There's definitely some stuff going on back in the day here. Right into the old foam pit. Whoa. Don't breathe that in. Don't be sucking on this water. Ugh, man, that just doesn't look good. You just know there's some bacteria living in there. I just knows it. I just knows it. Look at, I'm gonna pull something up right through it. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Ew, it's just nasty, dude. Oh, I better like clean it off. Yeah, what do we got here, you guys? Couple things, man. Oh, dude, look at what this is. It's one of them ice skate blades. Oh. Holy cow. You guys, couple things on there, but the first thing I noticed that this is one of them old school ice skating blades. You could see where it would screw into the bottom of like the shoe part where your foot would go on. And this is the blade. <laughs> Pretty cool, you guys, the old ice skate blade. Then we caught us some kind of ring here and that sucker is heavy duty. The old granddaddy door knocker. And then it looks like just a bunch of, ooh, ooh, a bunch of mangled up metal here. Not sure what that came off of. Let's 
something's tugging here. Oh, oh, oh. Tugging on the old magnet string. It was for a second. What happened? Oh no, it still is. Oh, I see some color. Hold on. Boom, you guys. Look at that fish and lured a big old spoon. Ew, what's on there? Was that bubble gum? What the heck is on there, you guys? Look at this thing. Looks like the old fishing rubber and it kind of looks like it was just snagged. I couldn't imagine putting that on there to go fishing. Rip the rubber off. Boom, and we got us a brand new looking big old spoon, you guys. That sucker's a couple bucks for sure. And really not even much rust on there. Couldn't have been on there too long. The old spoon. But there was also this thing on there you guys what do you think that came off of some kind of funky looking frame piece for something i don't know what to think of that one got a little pin coming off of there that's a goofy looking something you guys take a look at this cart man Oh, hold on a second, you guys. A little can top and a screw, a bunch of debris on there. But check this little thing out. Hold on. Is this some kind of canister? Yes, look it. Or look at there's like a little tab on the end there, you guys. But you can see the seam on it. And you can see it's a little shiny under there. This is some kind of like small container. Maybe there's something in there. Maybe a pocket watch or something. Look at the more I'm rubbing, I can rub some of this uh, rust off of there, you guys. We might have to clean this one up a little bit and see if we can tell what this is a little better. <laughs> you guys, look at this one. Alex found him the old water shut off valve. So I wonder if there was like a whole building here back in the day. It very well could have been, yeah. Pretty cool, you guys, and that's absolutely insane that it still turns. <laughs> Oh, yo, look at that sticking off of there, you guys. The old double ender wrench. And look at that one. Mine definitely is way older than the one that Alex found. Holy cow, you guys, not a shine on there at all. There seems to be all kinds of stuff in here. Oh, something snagging here. What do we got? I'm still waiting to pull up that uh, snag from last time, you guys. Oh, look at this sucker. Oh, look at this, you guys. That Whatever that is, like a great piece just fell off. But look at this. I got some kind of, uh, like a C-clamp. Yeah. yeah, the old little vice grip looking thing. Heck yeah. Oh. Hello. What do you got? See that color on there? I got me uh, one of those divers, right? Oh, that's a nice okay. one. Super yeah. Nice one for sure. Is this a musky lure? I don't know. Let, Let me see that part. sucker. Look at that, bro. Look, look at this, you guys. Part. That's a nice looking lure. Look at the bill on there. I've never actually seen one like that. Need some new hooks and you go old fashioned. That's a nice one, dude. Unfortunately, I don't think you're getting any usage out of this one anymore, you guys. Looks like this end is snapped off. Still super cool. And then this piece here that fell right off looks like some kind of maybe a grill great it almost looks like one of them uh like park grills that you usually see yeah, sure. that might be exactly what it is you never know oh look at that on there you guys first of all the little shiny piece this is definitely some kind of fishing device here. You can see the little red balls on there. I don't know exactly how to use this or what it is. I just know it is a fishing device. And then look at this piece here. This, I can already tell what it is, man. This is definitely some kind of electrical box. This would be behind the wall, like behind one of your light switches and it'd have a whole bunch of electrical wiring in there. Which again, like to go along with that water shut off valve that Alex found who knows man they're definitely starting to seem like there might have been a building or a factory or something here back in the day
Whoa, yo, okay, that's the leg off of like something. A coffee table or something, you guys. Look at that, the foot stand off of something for sure. Oh, I broke it, you guys. Check it out though. You can almost see like the, the design on there. Holy cow, what do you think that's off? Like a nightstand or a small coffee table? Super cool, man. Oh yeah. Oh, oh look at that there. Is that a sign? Oh. Oh, what the heck I is that, dude? So, dude? It's like a, like a rudder, like a boat rudder. Oh, maybe it is. It, it could be, right? Because look at the top. It looks like you put a pin in there. Yeah. Dude, this could be what it is. That's like, crazy. Like a steering shaft on it. <laughs> that is freaking cool. Oh. Oh, boink. I just stuck this out in here. Here it comes. This might be what you just it's lost. Got wrapped around it. No, this isn't That's what you had. Else. Yeah, this is definitely something else, dude. Whoa, you guys. We're pulling something apart down here, I think, for sure. I don't know what this is. Some kind of flap off of something, but you can see there's hinges on there. So definitely some kind of flap. Boy, that smells like oil, too. Oh, look at this. There's a big Star of David on there, bro. What? Yeah. Hold on, I got some. This is a dude. This looks very similar. Yeah, to whoa, hold on a second. What do I got here? I see something else with like a duct tape on there though. But look at this little fancy design piece. What do you think that came off of? Maybe something to do with that old coffee table leg or something? I don't really know you guys, but there was also this thing on here too. What is that? It's like a something with a nut and it's definitely duct tape dude i don't know what to think of that one you guys maybe something to do with plumbing or something i don't know but you guys check out this thing that yeah, alex found like six point star yes there is definitely a star on like there a, like a book, like a book but it can't open it oh it wants to like break yo no like don't it. don't pull on it that's like a that's a door latch is that what that That's is? That's a door latch, but there's a, what is the star for? I don't know. That's crazy. Yeah, kind of creeping me out. See that little notch in there that goes through like to a the keyhole. other side? It's almost like a quarter like a, inch extension. Like almost. a keyhole. Or yeah. Uh, weird. So take a look at this thing that Alex found here. First, it looked like a little booklet, but uh, if you look on the front, there's like a star. And it looks like maybe that's a keyhole, but this here is definitely like a door latch. So that's what makes me think it's definitely part of like a, door latch or something but i don't know that star is super crazy looking on the front of there you guys what do you think that is it almost looks like a little book man super weird what is going on Oh my, oh my, yo. That's a shame that there's no stand Dude. Sort of what there. the? What'd you just I think this is part of a wheelbarrow. It could be. Look at, <laughs> seriously, look at, or maybe it is like part of a wash tub. You can definitely see this is the frame of it. Like it goes in a square. Yeah. So <laughs> what do you think you guys? That, no, this is 100% a wheelbarrow. I yeah. guarantee you any money. Kind of Unreal. Strange, what the heck? This is getting wild. Oh, hey, look. You just found one of those too? Yeah. You guys, Alex found a second one of these flap looking things with the hinges on there. It's identical to the one that I found. Same exact thing. What in the world are these coming off of? Looks like the top to a fish tank. You open the top and feed the fish and close it. I don't know, man. Maybe it's a piece of our machine that we think that we're finding down there. And of course, the old uh, chunk of pipe. Can't go without the chunk of pipe on there. Oh, snow. Really? So now, you guys, I just found me one of these things that Alex yeah, found boy. before, only mine doesn't seem like it has a star on it. But again, it has like the door latch yeah. looking pieces. Yeah, you guys. Weird. What the heck are these things? Do they maybe go together or something? Unreal, man. Again, looks like a little booklet piece. What the heck are these?
Whoa. Oh, I almost dropped that. Dude, and it's exactly what I thought it was. Look, you can see the button on there. I just caught a flashlight. Holy cow, man. I don't even know. Yeah, look, you can still see the bulb in there. Oh my gosh, man. What's the year on that bad boy? What do you got? Oh, the old murder knife. Holy cow, seriously, that's pretty cool. <laughs> The old nighttime torch. Yeah. Check out these ones Alex just found on the old two for one throw. He called them the old hammerhead. And I always say this, you guys, you could probably push that little wooden piece out, throw a new one on, and it literally would be like a brand new hammer. And then he called me the old whoosh, whoosh, murder knife. Some seriously cool finds here today, you guys. Unbelievable. Look at this cart. We got stuff stacked on the boat. All right, you guys, we are off the river. We got everything packed up in the back of the truck here. Holy cow. Cow, what a day. It started off a little bit slow, but then once we got along that concrete wall there, holy cow, you guys, we just started stacking the cart. So we will definitely be back in the future, but that is gonna wrap it up for today. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. If you guys enjoyed this video today, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe, guys. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.